Filter in the Mega Millions numbers are out and within the past hour or so we've learned the record jackpot is growing no more. Julianne Lima is live in the newsroom with what we now know about the lucky winning ticket. Well, that's right, Danielle. It's a number that's hard to wrap your head around. $1.6 billion. And now we've learned one person or one group of people gets to keep all that money to themselves. That's right. Mega Millions is reporting just one jackpot winner in last night's drawing. And they apparently live in South Carolina. The state's official lottery website is reporting just one ticket matched all six winning numbers. We don't yet know the winner's name or what city they live in, and we may never find out. Unlike many states, lottery winners are allowed to stay anonymous in South Carolina. Now, as you've probably heard by now, this was the largest lottery jackpot in history. It beat the previous world record of $1.586 billion, which was the Powerball jackpot in January of 2016. But the odds of winning this historic prize, 1 in 302 million. It's so fun when it gets up that high, like it never gets that high, so I feel like I want to play this time. I'm not a normal player. Everybody else is playing, so I thought I'd get in the game. And we learned a pair of $1 million tickets was sold in Massachusetts. No big winners here in Rhodey, though. Now, if you didn't strike gold in last night's Mega Millions drawing, you could win big tonight in the Powerball drawing. That estimated jackpot is $620 million. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Julianne Lima, Eyewitness News.